Hello and welcome back, my beautiful froggy army, to another vlog. It feels like so long since I've seen you. Oh my goodness. In case you have somehow missed it, I've been posting a 30 day Animal Crossing no items island challenge for the whole past month. So to finally actually be vlogging again, feels great, feels great. I am testing out a new camera for this vlog. I bought a vlog camera. Finally, finally, I can stop using my phone. So still trying to figure out how this works. But the main appeal of it is that it's on like a little gimbal. So if I move it around, it's pretty smooth and I can like kind of jostle it a little bit and it's like not super shaky because that was my biggest problem with vlogs and I did get a few comments saying like that things were really shaky sometimes so I have like really shaky hands so this is absolutely perfect for me and I'm really excited for it. This footage in this vlog will kind of be a little experimental as I'm getting used to like all the settings and stuff but I'm sure you guys don't mind. We just got home from running some quick errands. We went and ate some tacos. They were pretty, they were pretty okay. I didn't enjoy mine as much as my boyfriend did but he did enjoy his so that's all that matters I guess. And then I did do a quick Target run. It was my friend's birthday earlier in the week so I have her birthday present and we have people coming over today and she's coming so I needed some stuff to wrap her present. I did try to vlog a little bit of that but I was really awkward. That was like the first thing that I tried vlogging with this new camera and I was like really nervous about it so I don't know it was a little awkward but we did go to Target. Maybe I'll put some of that footage right here. Of course I'm in the Squishmallow aisle. They don't really have any that I'm interested in today but I did find some of the new bum bums. We found this one which I definitely wanted and I found this little cupcake. Should I get this one? Do you think he's cute? Nope. No? Nope. Yeah, I don't really love that one. I am getting this one though. So cute. Wait, Hello Kitty. I don't need her. I don't. Oh my god. <laughs> Why are Sonic's arms not attached? What happened to him? What if I buy this and I just wear this indoors? It lights up. Okay. <laughs> the fact that I only found like one or two bum bums, like just stray ones, I think I missed like the display of them so i think we're out of luck for bum bums oh, this is so sad <laughs> he does look very Wait, interesting what is this i thought it was a board game get out of here <laughs> stuff we came here for acquired very many necessary purchases but now i do have to post my video for the day uh i forgot to schedule it i don't even know how ready it is i don't think it's like that ready at all so we're gonna go and post that right now and then i have to do a little bit of cleaning before people get here so and i was gonna show you what i got my friend for her birthday but i took it out of the package and <laughs> Oh my goodness, what happened? They just put this box into like a like a bag mailer and just put it in the mail. And it got so destroyed. I was gonna wrap the actual box in wrapping paper, but now I don't know if this is even possible. I mean, I guess I can like pop it back out. So anyway, I got her these super cute like bee and strawberry converse. Now I'm going to quickly wrap it, um, just put some wrapping paper over it, do a little fun bow thingy, and yeah. I think we're gonna go do this on a different surface because I have not vacuumed my office and it's full of cat hair, so let me not wrap this present on the floor with all the cat hair. Let's go somewhere else. This may be the worst wrapping job I've ever done in my life, but I was just not having it today, but it's done. I got such a headache a second ago, like while I was doing last finishing touches cleaning, I literally had to go lay down, like I was feeling really bad. We're gonna do a little bit of a squishmallow slash plushy haul of stuff that I've been getting. Like I mentioned earlier, I have been doing the 30 day challenge for the past month, so I haven't really done my typical like squishmallow hunting slash haul video. So I have quite a few that I have been buying, but I just haven't shown you and I'm not sure if I'll end up putting out a squishmallow hunting video of all the past footage that I have been collecting just because I've been collecting like 
April and May. So it's going to be like kind of outdated. I don't have very much anyway. So I think we're just going to do a haul. Ignore if the lighting is changing a bunch. I'm using my window for light today. So my biggest one that I got is this adorable little gal. Her name is Marla and she is the cutest little pink ladybug and I could not resist. Although I don't have any room for her on my pink shelf. I don't know where she's going, but how could I say no? She's a pink ladybug. Like... Yes. I don't remember what age I was, but I know it was in third grade. I had a ladybug themed party, so I absolutely needed her. At one of the semi-recent Five Below drops, I don't remember how long ago this was, but the one with like all the pets, I had to pick up Luann. She is the cutest thing. Like, I absolutely love it. Little possum. How could you not get this one? so cute oh and the ladybug was from walmart and then i also got this little lamb from walmart this is like i think a seven inch squad um this little jacob i already have like a five or four inch jacob so now i have a seven inch one to go along with the very excited one of my friends gave me this tuxedo sam like one of the newer kind of sanrio collection one i forget what it's called again i think it's like kaiju ones they're supposed to be like monster foods but so cute and you know i love tuxedo sam so i was so happy to get him so he's gonna go right there with all of the sanrio hello kitties sanrio hello kitties uh, sanrio squishmallows y you know what i meant <laughs> in one of my mystery boxes that i did here on the channel um i got this cute little Gigi. so i did end up deciding to keep her she is mine because i have an eight inch so i needed the five or i don't know is this five yeah the five inch to go with it and then at walgreens i have picked up a few um i had this bug on my iso list uh this one is giles oh i thought it was a different name giles gills i'm not sure but i got this little baby bug so cute love it so much you know i had to pick it up i'm very into the bugs lately and then i had to pick up the blueberry pancakes so cute this is payton something about like plushy pancake stacks really appeals to me and i'm not even a pancakes person so i don't know where it comes from but i just i love it the little blueberry on top chef's kiss and then this one you will be surprised to learn that i bought all on my own i actually bought a catacorn. I'm normally not a big fan of like the squishmallows that have horns on them that like aren't unicorns, you know? Like if they just put a horn on a panda, it's usually not my favorite thing ever, but this cat unicorn spoke to me. Like, I just love her little star embroidery. I don't know, it's so cute. <laughs> yeah, this is Sienna. So cute so cute and then last one i did end up picking up this little micro mallow from box lunch it was actually the display one and i asked if i could buy it and they let me because this is the only one out of like that wildlife squad that i'm actually interested in so i saw him and i was like i have to have him he's some sort of like boar pig thing it's like a species i've never heard of but it was really interesting when i was googling it but yeah, he's so cute. I just love him. I don't know why. I'm just obsessed with him. So that's it for Squishmallows, but I do have a few more other plushies. As you saw today at Target, I did buy this Bum Bums. Now, what is your name? This is Micah, and this is from like the Sweet Squad. So I think it's like a like a gumball, right? I'm not sure, but so cute. I've been very into Bum Bums, and I was really hoping to find like the summer tropical collection that's at Target, but we did not find it at all so and then i have a few palm pals that i picked up from claire's the other day i had to get this snail like i love palm pals but it's so funny when they give them like little legs for no reason like why does the snail have two legs it's so funny i love it i absolutely love snails so i did have to pick this one up so cute and then since i was buying some i was like why not get a whole bunch of them so i got two more i of course had to pick up the frog like what the heck i don't know why i don't have this one already yeah now i have the little frog i just I think he's so cute and i had to pick up the axolotl because look at that face look at that face those are all of the plushies that i've gotten recently oh, oh i have one more so as you know one of my favorite favorite squishmallows of all time is zozo the bigfoot and they recently came out with an eight inch graduation zozo now i graduated a couple years ago so i'm not graduating anytime soon or anything like that but I had to get her, okay? I had to get her. I got her for $20 and that's including shipping on eBay. So I thought that was an okay price, especially since she's like kind of newer, like just released. Oh no. Oh, we're gonna have to give her a trim. Wait, is it not supposed to have a tassel? 
or is it just a string i don't know on the on the tag it has a tassel and i really like the colors on her i feel like it has a good like variation and mix because i love just like all the different colors that the zozos can have it's just like a whole rainbow so yeah that's the plushie haul um now i just have a little bit of time to kill before people get here so yeah i'm just gonna find something to do i'll probably just scroll on tiktok because i have been doing stuff all day so i'll probably just scroll on tiktok until people get here but yeah nice checking in good to see you i'll catch you in a bit it is 1 a.m everybody just left while we played card games played board games had pizza had cake it was great very much well needed i have to edit a whole video for tomorrow i have not even started and it needs to post tomorrow at three so i think i'm gonna start that although i am kind of sleepy i'm just gonna get started and see how much progress i can make um i would say see you tomorrow but i'm not sure what i'm even doing tomorrow we'll see but i will see you most likely tomorrow but for now good night from this day raven if that makes sense you know what i mean hey it's been a few days i had like two days in a row where all i had to do all day was edit so today's the first day that i'm actually getting back to like doing stuff <laughs> so i just got done getting ready for the day so my desk is like an utter disaster with like makeup all over it so that's fun um my boyfriend is in a meeting so sorry if you can hear that a little bit but yeah, I'm cleaning up right now and then we're literally gonna go out and run some errands. So I thought you could come with me. I need to go get more cat food. That's the main thing. Like they're literally on their like last little portion of dry food. But since I'm going to get the cat food, I'm just gonna like check some stores nearby, you know? There's a Target nearby. So I'm like, mm, let's go to Target again. It's a different one that I went to like earlier in this video peppers in here <laughs> so i'm hoping that they have the bum bums and like a target run is always fun anyway so we shall go there and then we'll see how i'm doing on time we are gonna go play magic the gathering later so i need to like do some replacements for my cards that i play with i like have a deck that i already play with but i need to take some old cards out and put these new ones in so i have to do that at some point today so probably when i get back because i don't feel like doing it right now i've been doing my makeup at my desk i used to literally just stand at my sink and do it like standing for like an hour why did i do that and then i realized that i can just like put it all in like a little baggie and just bring it to a chair so i've been doing that and it's like much nicer that i can like sit down some makeup that i've been loving recently though i recently got l'oreal lash paradise hopefully that focuses or whatever this is so good i used to use the classic maybelline uh sky high mascara and i thought that this was the holy grail but it's not i love this so much better my eyelashes stick straight out and even if i curl them and put regular mascara on they don't stay up i have to curl them and use waterproof mascara so this is a waterproof mascara with the sky high i would have to curl my lashes twice and do two coats of this and it was getting really bad because i would have to curl them after putting on mascara which is bad don't do that but this one i can curl once and do one coat and they're good i literally have slept in this like with my lashes curled multiple times and they're still curled the next day I don't know what's in this it's probably not good for you but <laughs> whatever's in there it's really good it really works and then the other thing that i've been loving the lipstick i was wearing in the other clips at target is this wet n wild mega last stained glass it's like a lip gloss but it it's stained it's more of like a lip stain and i'm a big fan of like lip products that you don't have to reapply all the time just because i hate doing that <laughs> so yeah i've been loving those two things they're great but anyways, I think I'm mostly good to go. I think I need to get some pictures off of my Switch. Okay, so I'm just gonna do this really quickly and I will meet you in the car. I hit a stoplight, so hey, how we doing? I really want to like check a bunch of stores for Squishmallows because there's a bunch nearby, but I just don't have time today, unfortunately. So that's gonna have to be saved for another day. Anyways, my camera keeps falling over and we're about to get on the highway, so I will see you at Target. I'm at a stoplight and I literally just watched a cop do an illegal U-turn. Like there's literally a sign that says no U-turn. Just watched him do it. Love to see stuff like that. We are here, I'm excited, but we need to go over some ground rules. Okay, first of all, the spot next to the carts is the best spot. I don't care what anyone says, parking the first spot, the closest spot is not the best spot this is the best spot because what's the worst part about doing a huge target haul and huge shopping trip 
putting the cart away. This is the best spot because then you can just literally shove it right there. But ground rules. Okay, we are going in to check for bum bums and squishmallows. That's all we need. All right, are we ready? Let's go. Thankfully, coming to Target in like the middle of the day, there's not that many people here. Oh my goodness. What happened? <laughs> Oh my goodness, what is with this? The same bum bum is just here like with the squishmallows with no other bum bums in sight. Did I just miss them? I'm sad. It's so quiet. I feel like this is worse than it being crowded. <laughs> Why? I don't, I don't need this. I don't. I'm tempted. I know they had fish, like one that was in the shape of a fishbowl. That's the one I was like semi interested in, but. No sign of that. I was honestly not expecting to not buy anything. I know we had that pep talk, but I was fully prepared to um, break that promise to you. I was, I really was. I guess we can go to one more store. I think there's a Burlington nearby. I have been seeing that they've been getting some new cow hug me, so I guess let's just go see. Okay, Burlington, that's cute. We have one singular dino. Or no, that's a turtle. Oops. There's a unicorn and another one. Oh, another Henry. Literally as I'm walking out, I'm like, let me just like skim through this shirts on this aisle as I'm walking to the door. And lo and behold, I find some Hello Kitty shirts. It's been a downhill spiral from there. So I've been in here for like 20 minutes. I am gonna buy something. I found this cute little like tropical baby tee with like little pink sleeves. So cute. So I'm definitely gonna get that. And now it's just a matter of what Hello Kitty t-shirts do I get? So unfortunately there was like no shirts in my size. So I had to go for oversized. So I looked at all of them. Some of the designs I just knew I didn't like, like right off the bat, even when I found them on the hangers, but I was just picking them up just to show to you. So I had to get this. I absolutely love the fruit design and all of the Sanrio characters. I got the strawberry one. I thought this would be really cute. I'm just gonna wear these both like oversized, like with little shorts. But now I'm gonna pick up the cat's food and head straight home because I kind of took a while in there. We're done picking up their food and funnily enough, I got recognized in there. So Lauren, if you're watching this, hi, thank you for being sweet. Sorry I had to rush out, but now I'm gonna get on my way home. So yeah, I'll see you once we're home. Back home now and I have some Packages, obviously. I don't know if this is the best setup that I want to be in. I might want to sit on the floor. Let's go to the floor. I have been on whatnot way too much and I'm just buying clothes, buying clothes. I haven't really been going to the thrift store. I've been doing whatnot instead. So I guess that's, I don't know, does it even out, I guess. So just like the Hello Kitty t-shirts, I've kind of been into getting like oversized shirts just to wear with like shorts. Cause you know, it's going to be summer. So I want like something loose and breathable. So I got this, it's so cute. It's got like this little fake pocket kitty graphic. I thought it was really cute. But anyways, next package. These are some adorable plushies that I pre-ordered and I don't even remember pre-ordering these, but I got the email that like, they were being shipped out soon. And I was like, oh, I guess I did pre-order both of them. Here is the person's information. And they also gave me a cute sticker. Oh my goodness. And this is like a cute little art print. These are the plushies. They're so cute. I love them so much. This lighting is a little funky right now. I closed my blinds like a little bit. I think that's better. I think it was looking really blown out before. Okay, but yeah, there's the plushies, maybe in better lighting. It's hard to tell also because this camera, like, viewfinder screen is, like, literally so tiny. It's, like, the size of, like, my two thumbs, so I can't really tell what's going on. I just know that I'm in frame. If I'm out of focus or if the lighting is weird, I have no clue. But anyway, moving on to our next package. I found this cute little shop run by just one person and it's called Booze, Bees, and Buddies. And I found it because I was searching for Squishmallow mystery boxes and they had like a Squishmallow mystery listing. Oh my goodness, right off the bat, we have some Squishmallows. Ah, <laughs> I'm so excited. So obviously first we have an 
Avery. I'm sad I already have Avery, but like, I love him. That is a cutie patootie. And next, we also have Obu, who unfortunately I also have. So those are two great squish. Oh my goodness. First, we have a little baggie of some Squishmallow goodies. So I think these little packs are what come with the Squishmallow mystery boxes that I got because I got another similar one. So I ordered five gumball lotteries, which is like a cute little gumball machine and like you get something out of it. So that's what's in here. So let's open that. Cute little like kitty plushie. That is so adorable. We got this little guy. He is so small. And I got like a mystery um, like candy bead like confetti. And it even comes with string so I could like make something. So then I ordered like a mystery mini scoop. So like they scoop a bunch of beads and then every bead corresponds to something that I'll get. So that's what all of these are. So this is all the stuff that I got in that scoop, which is awesome. I'm not sure like what's what. I just know that everything is fun and cute. So I got like all of these cute little like bead like mystery bead thingies mystery stickers more mystery stickers i'm so sorry if you hear my cat i'm not letting them in right now and she's very upset i got a little crystal necklace then i'm on to the next bag and look this one comes with a little squish fill also wait this one's kind of different from the one that i have I think the one I have is like way more red and she's like more pinky. Cute little pom-pom keychain. Oh my goodness. I was just looking at the pom-pom on my keys today and I was like, wow, this thing's getting really gross. I should probably replace that soon. So perfect timing. We got some little like mystery bracelets slash jewelry. There's a little pink ring in there. That's really cute. And I got another pom-pom. Cute. I got some stationary confetti. That's really cute. There's like mini notepads, a little pen, paper clips. <gasps> a little like eraser in the shape of a strawberry and then i think this is one of my mystery confetti it has like a little scrunchie and like some little jewelry things beads stickers all kinds of fun stuff in there oh lots of little shiny trinkets and goodies for me to go through and then i got fidget toy confetti so yeah that's pretty much it that was really fun i really like the mystery aspect of it and like all the different confetti and little things that i got so i'll link them down below um it's a really cute shop so <laughs> i i had a lot of fun opening this anyways now i think i'm gonna get a snack and do like my card things that i've been talking about and then after that we gotta get going to go play our card games so yeah Okay, I'm back home from playing Magic. I don't remember what the last thing I said was. I think it was that I had to replace my cards. So I ended up rushing out the door with not enough time to do that because typical. So I had to do that literally while we were there. And then I didn't film anything while we were there because I ended up playing like without our usual group. So I didn't want to like record random people, you know? I had kind of a headache coming back home. So now I just kind of want to relax. So I have some Walmart brand Nutella and some strawberries and I'm going to listen to some music, eat this and play Minecraft and just have a great time. I have an appointment I have to go to tomorrow at noon and then Tropical Smoothie Cafe is giving away free smoothies tomorrow. So I think I maybe want to go to that. I don't know, just get a free smoothie. It is the next day and we're starting off in my car today. I had my appointment this morning. It went good, it went good. And of course the people next to me have to be coming in to their car as soon as I hit record. Oh my goodness. But anyways, I think I mentioned it yesterday but Tropical Smoothie Cafe has like free smoothies today. So I need to kill time for that. It's about one o'clock and it starts at two. So I think I'm going to grab some food because I didn't eat anything because my appointment was right at noon so I haven't eaten. So I'm going to get something to eat and then depending on how much time we have I might kill time somewhere. Just go in a random store and then go get our smoothie. So yeah, let's start off by getting some food. <laughs> I killed so much time in there. It's not even funny. I wanted to get this like lunchable type of thing. Um, it was $8 for crackers, meat, cheese, and grapes. So instead, I got cheese, $3, pepperonis, $3, 
a box of crackers, three dollars. A bag of grapes, a little over a pound. It was like three sixty. Spending two extra dollars, I got way more food than the individual portion. I need to wash these, so I probably won't eat those right now. But I'm gonna have some crackers and cheese and meat and just enjoy myself. I also got this little mango drink, so that'll be nice. Um, I got myself a dark chocolate because. I'm gonna need it soon, just let me say that. And I love this raspberries and dark chocolate. And I got some honey oatmeal raisin cookies because I just thought they sounded good. Anyways, let's eat. Hey, I'm back. So I ran into Tropical Smoothie Cafe. There was a ton of people and everything, so I didn't wanna like record, but I got it free little smoothie cute so it's like a predetermined flavor they literally had like coolers of them just like ready to go i'm sorry i have to have the ac on right now because it's burning up in here but i think this is like strawberry margarita so it's like strawberry and like lemon and lime that's interesting that's interesting hmm the lemon and the lime mixed together is kind of like an interesting combo like plus strawberry probably wouldn't order it on my own but i'll enjoy it because it was free i think i'm just gonna go home now i killed enough time shopping for my food that uh yeah it was just free smoothie time and now that's all i have planned for today so so if i do anything else interesting today i'll definitely let you know using my phone to end off the vlog because my camera is charging but i'm editing this video right now and it's getting pretty long so i'm gonna end it here but thank you so much for hanging out with me i hope you enjoyed the vlog i'm definitely gonna be doing some more irl content this month because i'm having fun with the camera it makes it a lot easier for me to film and just because i need a little bit of an animal crossing slash gaming break so i hope you join me along for that and tune in to whatever i post hopefully a squishmallow video will be coming up soon that's most likely going to be the next one that i post so keep an eye out for that thank you again for hanging out with me don't forget to subscribe and everything if you like the content and i will see you in the next one